Welcome to A State of Sight. I'm Isaac Porter and this is your update in ophthalmology and eye care from Raleigh. Today we have a special episode because we're going to explain the triple procedure which is corneal transplant along with cataract removal and lens placement. Now recently we had a question from Joshua at APE 12A who was wondering about this procedure because soon he's about to undergo it. Now uh, with him he had a corneal transplant 17 years ago and now needs to have that transplant replaced. 17 years is a pretty good lifespan for a corneal graft. Um, in the best case situations like keratoconus, we may expect a corneal graft to last 15 to 20 years on average, which is why many patients need a graft repeated during their lifetime. Uh, because of this, we like to wait until the graft is absolutely necessary, but then when it is, we go ahead and do it. Uh, so his case is a little bit different. He's going to have the exchange of a corneal graft, then the placement of a new one after the cataract is removed and the lens is implanted. And with this type of procedure, we can remove the cataract differently than we usually do. When we generally remove a cataract, we just make a very small incision at the edge of the cornea and then use ultrasound and suction to help break up the cataract and remove it from the eye. But when we're doing this with the triple procedure, since we're doing a corneal transplant at the same time, the entire cornea is removed first in the center and we have a large area to access the cataract. So with this, we can open up the lens capsule and then remove the cataract. And we can remove the cataract manually in one large piece instead of breaking it up and having to take it out in small pieces. Then after this, we'll put in a lens implant and a lot of times we like to use a more rigid lens implant or a, a different type that may be a little bit larger to uh, replace the cloudy lens that's removed the cataract in order for patients to see better and we just put that lens implant through the large opening in the center of the cornea then after that we will continue with the corneal transplant and put the new donor cornea tissue into place by sewing it around and replacing that central spot. Now this is only available when we're doing the full thickness corneal transplant, which is called penetrating keratoplasty. If we go for other types of corneal transplantation, like DSEC or DALK, then we have to remove the cataract in a different way or more of the standard way because we don't have access large with the opening like we do with the full thickness graft. So if you have any questions about the triple procedure, please post. We'll be happy to answer them and hopefully see you again soon next time on A State of Sight.